Uh, you're watching a hands-on review of the pen, of the, the Augins, the book. My name is Nate Great. I'm the editor of the Digital Reader blog. So I'm going to take you through a few steps and show you what I can do with um, browsing. First things first. I have to get this connect to the Wi-Fi, my network. Scanning. And what's rather odd is that even though it's in the next room, it can't find my Wi-Fi network. That's really weird. Wi-Fi range is really limited. This wasn't the demo I was planning to do, but I guess it will do. Okay. So as you can see, the other options, buy books, register, music, and video player. It's going to take you down to the notepad. Okay, actually, I didn't plan to have the font that big, but it works. It is rather usable, but it has hardly any options, just import and export. Um, it's a strict text one, strict ASCII text one, actually. So, really have hardly any f features here. But it's good for basic note-taking, at least. I don't have any video or music loaded, unfortunately. So, let's run through the settings. You can change the brightness. Um, format internal memory, set time, so on and so forth. I've taken this out in the sun, it's reasonably clear. Oh, only two languages, huh? That's interesting. English and simplified Chinese. Well, that tells me who did development work on this one. So as you can see, we have one option here, continue reading. It's going to open up a PDF. Interesting. I'm going to use home to go back. I opened up the favorites folder and I opened this is an EPUB book I already was already reading. So as you can see, reasonably fast page turn. Let's see here. Showed you the showed you the text to speech in the other one. Bookmarks rotate. Yeah. Okay. This is really beginning to grow on me. Um, it, it's rather buggy though, but for $100, it's not bad. Anyway, my name is Nate the Great. I'm the editor of the Digital Reader blog, and you're looking at Augen the Book.